Hello and welcome back to ASM Sakai where we discuss all things anime and we have an exciting episode today. I am Suhi joined as always with my wonderful co-host Moto. We're going to be diving into the new spring anime of Marshall. Marshall, Marshall, however you oh. want to say it. We're going to be exploring this unique storyline, characters, theme, whether you're a longtime anime fan or you're a recent weeb that is just joining the Japanese animation, the culture, the beauty of anime. So sit back, relax, and let's get started. Man, what's up? I didn't know oh. we were talking about Masho, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> you threw a fucking curveball. You always do, you piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I didn't realize the background was not enough, right? You know, I didn't I give mean... that away. Randomly, I'm just going to say mm -hmm. that one. Uh, anyway, so I like surprising Moto. Uh, Moto, you just saw the recently the second episode today, right? Yeah, first and the second episode, man. That shit's funny. Um, I'm on chapter 104 as well, the manga, so... You you tell me how you, you're you're pumped about it. I want to hear about it. Okay, so you're a Harry Potter fan, so so when I first saw this, it felt very Harry Potter esque, but the trailer itself looked kind of goofy. And it is. Goofy. Let me tell you something. This show has exceeded my expectation. It is so funny, absolutely amazing humor, especially in episode two that just came out. Um when everybody is so fake like you know in awe with the the great freaking student professor whatever he is and masha just like pointing out the obvious he's like instead of using yeah. your magic you could have just prepared for <laughs> us a whole room yeah he's like why don't you just have the chair already right like, the, what the hell <laughs> The comedic timing is so amazing. It reminds me of Gintama. And it, yeah. it's, like, it's like a very... It's a combination of a lot of things. It reminds me of Saitama. I really hope Mosh and Saitama battle. I really, really hope they fight. Because <laughs> I don't know who's stronger. I don't know who's stronger. Um, there's a lot of moments where... Exactly, like it, it reminded me of Black Clover, how Asta got you know introduced, no magic, everybody looked down on him, like you know, he was the person getting picked on. But the way Mosh is, like, his character is so humble, so pure, yeah, he's easy to get, yeah, he's um, <laughs> and, and, and he he's sad. so naive, he's so naive, and the fact that he is in front of Gandalf, and this is just like freaking Harry Potter, holy shit, bro, um. This is Japanese Harry Potter and me and my wife watching it. I am cracking the fuck up. And when he told Gandalf, not Gandalf, fuck my Harry Potter <laughs> shit, Dumbledore. Uh, when he fucking told Dumbledore that he'll beat him up or he'll punch him. I was just like, bro, I can't wait to see more. Yeah, he's like, yo, yeah, I would just pummel you until I won. <laughs> it's it's no, he... diff Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, man, like this this show, um, I think one of the, the cool thing about animations, it usually takes a good manga and it gets animated, right? That's that's a good good sign. That's a good sign. So I'm always pumped about uh, a lot of these things. I think a lot of people love Harry Potter, right? Because it's a creative, entertaining world. It's great. So, and especially our age, maybe, uh, like it connects even more because of like our, we were how old in the 20s, early 20s, um, when Harry Potter came out. I would say so. Yeah, that's fair. It yeah. was uh, so, right you know, after had, the Lord of the Rings. Yeah, so we had this big, uh, you know, eight, nine, ten year stretch of just Harry Potter. You know, so we have this such a passion connection to Harry Potter, right? Like it, it wasn't like our parents were introducing to us. It's something that we we, we grew up yeah. with. Yeah, and then this this comedic connection to Harry, and there's there's a lot more coming up. And that's the oh, hilarious man. part. And then and I just love the also like you know all this magic and then the the physical guys like, but you could just have the chair out or like just go through the one and like every every trick it's like oh why don't we just do it this way <laughs> and it's like god damn it. <laughs> I I really like how they keep um you know every anime or every great show has their comedic routine where in this one it is that he doesn't know how to open or close the door that's where he gets confused so he's always breaking the door so we were introduced to him 
that way with his fake grandpa, you know, Goku. So I really like how they have so much homage to uh, different animes. Like, that's really not his grandfather. Just like Goku's was in Son Goku, like the grandfather. I really like how they're going... Yeah, Son Gohan, sorry. And I really yeah. like how they're going in that pure throwback anime route as, at the same time giving this Harry Potter thing. And I don't think we can ever, 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 and I think I speak for all anime fans, get tired of magic animes. Anything that's related with magic and wizards and witches, we look forward to it because the realm of possibilities is endless. And Black Clover is an example of how even though it started off shit, like I really hated Asta, <laughs> really hated him, but I was like, it's magic, believe in it. It paid off truly tenfold. Yeah, man. Like, I, I didn't know, like, just the cuteness, smart, like, it just keeps on going too. And that's what's great about it. And that's how creative, like, the magic worlds are. That's like, you already know this. Like, I always kind of, deduct points i guess if you use the real world like i'm like it's kind of boring <laughs> like uh tokyo okay no thanks <laughs> like yeah i could go myself it's more exciting but like when you start creating this real world like oh yeah that's fucking it. i think that's one of the reasons harry potter is so cool right but it's kind of in the real world selling but then it's like you go through the like the secret the nine three quarter uh train station and then it goes to the hogwarts and it's oh it's completely different world it's so fascinating to see it's the same thing with every magic world like you said with black rover it's like completely different world different dynamic and that's one of the reasons why one piece and we always have to get one piece in <laughs> in the our greatest. clips it's the greatest because it's just the imagination the magic of the world is just fantastic so yeah this one's gonna be a, a comedic style i think uh it's it is a very action oriented so i'm excited to see how you're you're like but especially a big harry potter fan that you are i think you'll enjoy like everything to be honest I just love how he just punches shit. And he broke through the maze with his hand, which I expected. I expected him to do that. And when he came out, everybody was booing him. And I I love how fucking stupid he is. Like, it's so refreshing to see such a stupid, powerful character because it fits his personality. Um... Uh, and I really like the colors and how the artwork was when they were in the uh, in the yard of the um, of the school, the academy, and it felt very Harry Potter. It was massive. It looked just like the scene straight out of Black Clover, but Black Clover felt more of a coliseum, while this felt like a massive castle. Really well done. Uh, the music was hilarious. I loved. I really enjoyed this goofiness. It's such a refreshing refreshing feeling to cheer for a goofy ass anime i mean we've been watching uh, what what have we been watching a lot of recently it's demon slayer aot jjk chainsaw they're all very dark hell's paradise which we will talk about later <laughs> so it is very refreshing to get a comedic uh, relief have you ever had a cream puff by the way i want more i want them i feel like i have but not that one yeah, it's good, man. Like, I, I kind of wanted to work on, like, the food of each show. Because every show has, like, it's th their food. I wonder if uh, Japan is going to go, like, you know, some kind of uh, uh, mushroom thing, like a cream puff or something. Oh, I'm pretty sure there's already some. Okay. Uh, we just have to find, yeah. Oh, yeah, the cream puff is very common in Japan. So, right, it's... It's it's funny. I think a lot of these manga because like okay, we know we have curry. Everybody knows about curry, <laughs> ramen. Everybody knows about ramen. Yeah. Now you could have the ramen. <laughs> so this show is like okay, oh, yeah, I'm gonna go with cream puff. <laughs> that's a sick. That's that's, a great a, that's that's great. And especially yeah. looking at this picture, um, so far he has broken three wands. Three. I think sure. he broke uh, in episode one. He did. He broke in right. episode one. Uh, he actually a four. Remember, he threw his grandpa's wand or somebody's wand right by the dude's face. <laughs> but did that break? I felt like it broke. I don't know. So far, he has broken a lot of wands, and I really love it. I love how he just randomly just snaps it, and um, uh, especially the guy, the guy in the beginning who was trying to enforce the law for magic, and yeah. he's like nobody mm -hmm. without magic, and now he's cheering him on. Uh, like, <laughs> yeah, what the fuck, disguise? <laughs> what the fuck? 
See, uh, th- it, uh, those things are like it reminds me of Gintama, and it is a g- it is r- a really good it's, thing. It's good change of pace, man. It's good change of pace. Like I'm excited. Um, I again like most of the show we like, uh, and right, rightfully I I th- we think right. It's pretty dark. <laughs> like ALT is like, yo, this show is pretty fucked up when you think about it, <laughs> right? So I, I think it's nice to get those refreshing uh, moments. Um, so what do you think? What other Harry Potter reference would you like to see? Snape. That's one question. And then... Professor Snape. Hey, I want to yeah, see yeah. Professor Snape. <laughs> Professor Snape. God damn. And then... Dobby. Uh, what, what's, what do you... What do you Dobby. Yeah, the elf, bro. The house elf, Dobby. <laughs> I mean, uh, if there's elves, uh, like Harry Potter, elves are a very huge part of Harry Potter. Uh, yeah. B- yeah, no. so are there elves in uh, Mushal? I'm trying to think. I, I don't think I've seen them yet. No, um, I, I don't think not... there's elves. So I I, yeah. I I hope there is like a, I we saw Malfoy we saw the Malfoy whatever be whatever be because he was uh outside smiling in I'm like that's Malfoy and his crew Slytherin <laughs> right there easily that's easy to deduce uh but I really want to see if they have a Hagrid you know Hagrid version okay. somebody yeah, that yeah. likes him yeah uh also Professor Snape if there is somebody like Professor. that because, uh that would be nice uh, how about something more general not specific character but general that like just. The... The world, Harry Potter, what would you like to see? The brooms, the Quidditch, if there is Quidditch, yeah. but possibly. Uh, Quidditch is an awesome part of Harry Potter. Um, yeah, yeah uh, that's basically... Oh, giant creatures and stuff. That's a big thing in Harry Potter. Mm-hmm. Dragons is a huge part. Um, yeah. Yeah, and dark dark wizards. Yeah. Duck yeah, yeah, you'll get yeah, like, yeah. De- like dementors, think... werewolves. Um, there's what unicorns, centaurs. There's so many things. Harry Potter. Yeah, a lot of different beasts, right? Like yeah, yeah. magical beast. Yeah, okay, no, yeah, okay. the I fantastic you, 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 Yeah, you'll be surprised with a few of them. <laughs> I, I will spoil. I, I can't I, spoil this. That's why I was asking general questions. So. So, <laughs> and what well, do you think is gonna happen next? So uh, let's answer this. Let's wrap it up. I want to know your rating, Sue, since you can compare manga to animation. So I would be good. My rating is already ten out of ten. Um, what do you? Th- <laughs> what do I? Th- no, so it exceed expectation for me. That's why. So okay, I'm going to give okay, it ten. Okay. Respectfully, I'm going to give it ten. Not comparing it to any other anime. I just comparing it to itself. Um, what I expect it to be. It's better than what I expected. It's hilarious. I am excited for it every single week now. That's something I'm looking forward to. What happens next is he's going to somehow convince uh, his roommate, Ron, Ron 2.0, um, to support him. <laughs> Hermione's eventually going to be... I really love the comedy where it's like, oh, he asked me to marry him. He goes, no, I didn't. It's like, those stuff is awesome, but this is not Hermione. This is more like, you know... Ginny, but yeah, whatever. Um, I ju- I'm just excited for the ride. I want this stupid show to excite me like it is right now. Um, that's what okay. I'm gonna say. Um, no, that's good. That's good response. Uh, I I don't know why you're asking me for rating after two episodes, but uh, I'll well, say how, um compared to manga. So oh, in terms of adaptation, so far I would say it's like a solid adaptation where they kind of pretty much copy and paste, so you don't get any uh, anime style. Uh, the one like, for example, just to give you like a great adaptation where they go beyond my expectation is like Demon Slayer. Like that's why I always say about Demon Slayer, and I think that's why it's God so tier. popular. Yeah, it's it's. It's when they add stuff that always enhances and takes away something that probably doesn't fit too well in the anime format. So, you know, it, it's it's that beautiful balance in animation and presentation, I think is what I would call the top tier. And then so a lot of the uh, anime just takes takes the, the content and copy and paste. And then there's the anime that takes the, the, the manga content and is like, eh, we could do better, and they totally fuck it up. Like, you know... Promise Neverland, season two. Piece of <laughs> shit. Uh, so yeah, so I think it's it's doing a good job. Uh, it's 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 what I expected. Uh, animation quality, I don't think it's anywhere near you know any of the top top tier ALT uh, you know Demon Slayer. I don't JJK, expect it to but, be. 
Yeah, it's a comedy action show. It's great. It does what it needs to. It's it's humorous. It's a great uh great one after the tear jerker we probably have with Demon Slayer. <laughs> This, hey, has, me. this has been an episode of ASM Sakai. I hope you enjoyed our discussion on the newest spring anime, Marshall. Um, I we recommend it. We highly recommend yes. if you yeah. are yes. into anime, this is something you should really check out. This is something that's going to keep you entertained for a very long time. Yeah, it's it's a pretty yeah. It's still ongoing. It's it's yeah. It'll keep you busy for at least four or five seasons, I think. I hope. So make it's sure the you blue like... lock season. No, <laughs> it's completely different. But uh, you know what? I can agree to some. You know what? I can agree to it respectfully. Spring anime, different season. Agree. Make sure you like and subscribe to ASM Sekai, Suhi, Moto. We will catch you later. Peace out.